Welcome to Get Dressed with Merrick. I'm so glad that you're here today. We are gonna be talking about how to style old trendy pieces in modern new ways. I'm sure you had those pieces that you bought five or 10 years ago that were super trendy at the time. You love them, you still love them, but they hang in your closet because you don't know how to wear them without making it feel like it's 2005. On my Instagram, I started a new series called In or Out and you guys submit trends to me that you're not sure if they're in or out and I give responses to them. It's really fun. I have it saved in the highlight if you wanna check it out. And I made a list of all of them and I put them in the blog post today so you can see all of them and I chose four and I showed you how I wore it back then and how I would wear it now. You can totally still wear a lot of those pieces. You just have to know what to pair them with and how to pair them so that they don't feel outdated. The number one request was the chambray shirt. I'm sure you have one of these in your closet. I had several, I've now pared it down to one that I've still hung on to all these years. And honestly, I don't wear it that much anymore because it does feel quite outdated. We all wore it so much and now it just feels like it belongs in the past. But you can totally still wear it. And I'm gonna show you some styling ideas and some styling tips today on how to wear this in a way that feels fresh and modern. I pulled some photos from my archives of me wearing chambray shirts. And one of them was with a bubble necklace and white skinny jeans and neon heels. So it's really not a bad outfit, but it was from 2014 and it was very obviously so. We all were wearing the bubble necklaces. We were all wearing the neon shoes. So I'm gonna show you how to make it feel a little bit more current. Same shirt, we're just gonna make it modern. In the 2014 outfit, I had low rise white skinny jeans on, which we all wore those. I still love white skinny jeans, but instead of the skinny jeans, which are still a good choice, I'm gonna do a more current version of white pants. I'm gonna do these wider leg high rise pants. They just feel a little bit more current, a little bit more modern. And instead of the neon heels, which number one was completely not practical for my life as a mother of small children, but also neon is much less of a trend right now. I would do a neutral ankle boot, which is a classic option or a pair of fun sneakers. So I'll show you both and let's decide together which one I should do. Okay, here's option one, the tan ankle boot or the sneaker. Now the sneaker is a little bit more practical for my everyday life, but I feel like with these pants, because they're wide leg um, and long, I think that a little bit of a heel helps just elongate my look so I don't get a squatty look. And instead of a bubble necklace, I'm gonna go with a really simple gold necklace. It kind of gives just a little bit of interest here, especially since I'm keeping the neckline quite open here, but it doesn't draw that flashy, bright attention, keeps everything neutral and also feels very current. If you still have bubble necklaces in your closet, it's time to get rid of them. Instead, swap them for some delicate gold jewelry like this. I'm just going to roll my sleeves up like this for just kind of an effortless, casual look. And then I have updated that old outfit with the same shirt into something that feels more modern, more neutral, more elevated, a little less 2014. What do you think? I like it. Okay, now I'm gonna show you two other ways that you can wear the chambray shirt in a way that feels still modern. Option one is with a high-waisted midi skirt. These are very popular right now. This is actually a tiered skirt, which are also very popular right now. And I would pair this with a pair of modern sandals like this. Braided sandals are hugely popular and just gives it kind of a modern and elevated look. And again, with a little bit of gold jewelry, simple earrings, waist defined. This feels very 2022. Or another easy way that you could wear it is with a t-shirt dress like this. This one has a slit up one side and you can tie it around your waist to give a little waist definition. Now this t-shirt dress already kind of hugs my um, side a little bit, but if you have a t-shirt dress that's boxy, this is a great way to add a casual layer and also define your waist. And I always do it like this with the collar down here and facing out. If you face it in this way, you can get some lumps and bumps that you probably don't want. So I face it out this way. And then you can tie like this, or if you're worried about it falling out, you can double knot it like that.
And then I would wear this with a pair of sneakers or a pair of leather sandals. Something classic, chic, simple, and you've got a great mom outfit. And of course, whenever I put together a mom outfit, I love to add a baseball hat. Which one do you think? Sometimes it just takes a little bit of creativity to take your old pieces that were super trendy at the time and wear them in fun, modern ways. I hope this was helpful. Check out more on the blog today. I'll see you next week.